There's a rumor online that I wondered if you could talk about. So during your elimination lip sync against um, Robbie Turner, um, you the, the rumor is is that you cut your leg and that's why you had to have first aid. And if you look at the before and after, you're wearing red tights before and then after at the end of the lip sync, you're not wearing them anymore. Um, so I was just wondering, is that true? Absolutely. It's true. Absolutely it's true. Um, when, um, well, back in the days, I don't know today, uh, like I said, there's a couple of things that change to production wise and, and details. But back in the days, you used to do your lip sync for your life. They used to film that twice. Okay. Um, when I did my first shot, you know, filming my lip sync against Robbie Turner, uh, when I did my split, here's the problem. We have the wheels um, runway look, right? A couple of the girls, they break some of the light bulbs on the stage, you know? They tried to clean the mouse, but it was particles of light bulbs on the floor still. That's why, if you notice, now on the main stage, the lights that are surrounded on the catwalk, they are different. Now there's LED, they don't have light bulbs anymore for liability. Because what happened to me? Because as soon as I did the split, I was bleeding on my right knee. Um, and uh, something that um, I didn't talk about, you know, but I'm going to, you know, talk to you because we're, we're serving tea, honey, is that as soon as I finished my lip sync, since I was so weak, because everything that were happening to me with the symptoms of liver cancer stage one, I faint on stage. I fall. They need to bring paramedics. Um, the, uh, Cynthia, are you okay? You know, um, and then like when I returned back to conscious, um, they were like, oh my God, like, are you sure you want to do the lifting for your life for the second time? And I'm like, no, I'm here to work. So I will do it. But they wait. They say like, no, we want to make sure that everything's okay with you. Um, and they wait like 15, almost 20 minutes. And Mama Ru left you know, to have her conversations <laughs> and things, you know. And when we came back, she said, like, are you OK, cool? And I'm like, I'm OK. I'm going to do this. If, if this is my episode, I'm going to go all the way to the end. And they were like super surprised by my reaction because I really looked very skinny on camera. I lost 42 pounds in a week of filming. And I was having um, constant diarrhea. My skin looks completely pale and jello because, of course, my my my. My liver cancer was fighting against my immune system and my body, imagine. Um, and they were like super concerned. That day I have a doctor coming to the workroom, give some, uh, do some blood work, send to the lab. Again, the experience that I had with World Wonder was phenomenal, spectacular. They are so professional. And I'm not saying this, honey, because I want to come back to the TV show. I'm not that way because I'm an honest person. I'm just saying my experience with me, the interaction and the way that they work with me was really professional and was really nice. Um, even like I said, like they don't have the, they have the responsibility to take care of ourselves. So they might probably take us to a medical center or anything, but they decide to bring a doctor uh, to, to the workroom. I mean, so, so things like that, you know? And I decided to do the second lip sync, and that's when you see me and all the entire, like, you know, viewers of the show that I don't have the red, horrible fish, red fish nets. And uh, if you see closely, I have a band aid. <laughs> and I was showing my bare legs. <laughs> that's, I'm very picky with my drag. I mean, a little bit of disconnection on bad taste in fashion, because <laughs> I recognize it, you know, now that I watch the show several times to learn. But at the same time, I always wear like fishnets or, or fishnets or pantyhose, you know. So yes, the the rumors are true. Um, but the production was very nice. RuPaul and RuPaul and his team was very very nice. They were very, very concerned. Um, I do believe, you know, Robbie killed the lip sync. But of course, my body wasn't given the one hundred percent of the energy for the lip sync because I was experiencing the illness. So that was the reason why. Um, I have to send home. I, 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 they have to send me home. You know what I'm saying? Ripple decided to say, like, we have to um, eliminate you, Cynthia, you know, but as soon as I get eliminated, uh, the doctor sent me back again, and they said, like, I need you to take this referral to your doctors in Austin, Texas, 
because you need more studies because I don't know. I, I think there's something going on with you, your jello eyes, your jello skin. This is not normal, you know? So it was a mix of a couple of things, you know what I'm saying? But, you know, for the safety of my participation on the TV show, the production being concerned about my my health wise and all my, you know, mental, um, you know, everything, everything, everything. They said, like, you need to see a doctor right after. Wow, that's crazy for um that's like a crazy story. And I I mean I'd heard the rumor, I've talked about it on my channel before, but it's it's interesting to hear that you're confirming it's true. Um obviously very sad that you got eliminated. And I obviously you um your liver cancer. We will talk about that in a minute. You you talked about it on season nine as well. So just sort of going back, so you you said that they do the lip syncs twice, and I guess that's to get like different camera angles and stuff. Do they do that now, or is that just something they used to do in the old days? Honestly, um, I don't know as much. Um, I think um. I heard rumors that some of the lip syncs, they do it twice. They still doing that, uh, you know, method and technique just to make sure that they have all the juicy stuff that happened hunting during the lip sync, you know? Um, if you lost a wave, you lost a high heel, you know? And we know stories, you know, that we saw in the episodes for some All-Stars edition or regular season that people is losing something, somebody parts in the middle of the lip sync, you know? So... I'm assuming because it happens um, that some, you know, my siblings, you know, um, at the end, they told me like, you know what, I, they just put the bad edit because we filmed this twice. I'm like, OK, so that means they still doing it, you know, um, but or, or weeks or falling on stage, you know, things like that. <laughs> so that day of the reunion, you know, behind the scenes. I saw a couple of the girls, a couple of my sisters talking, like, I don't know who's going to be Miss Congeniality. All of them, they were asking me. I was I, I was saying, you know, to a group of my sisters when we were ready, uh, uh, you know, before the reunion. Like, But I think also Valentina was a very popular, you know, in all entire social media. Everybody loved her. And some of my sisters were looking at me like, no, we don't think so. She was popular. Congenial? I don't know. And I'm like, okay. And by the way, I can tell this. From all the sewing machines that you see on the workroom, just only one works. One. And they do that, of course, to make it a little bit like a difficult for everybody, you know, to complete and execute and finish all her looks. Uh-huh. You know, I love them, but... And for season nine, it happens a little bit the same. Instead of one, it was two because it was a big group, you know. Um, but um, when the designer, I spilled some tea already. Woo! 